welcome. I'm Leo. Today we are getting to know time. Here is an analog clock face. It is marked with twelve numbers, one to twelve. There are two hands. The shorter blue hand I am pointing to right now is called the hour hand. And the longer yellow hand I am pointing to is called the minute hand. First, let's focus on the hour hand. The hour hand is pointing to two, so basically it's two o'clock. Now let's look at another example. The hour hand is pointing to seven. So it's seven o'clock. Now let's do two more examples. Here, the hour hand is pointing between three and four. Is it three o'clock or four o'clock? The rule is, when the hour hand is pointing between two numbers, it goes with the smaller number. Three is the smaller number in this case, so it's three o'clock. Now let's do another example. Here, the hour hand is pointing between seven and eight. According to the rule, it's seven o'clock. Now let's answer this question: What is three hours after two o'clock? So here is our analog clock. It goes from smaller numbers to bigger numbers. This is called clockwise. One hour from two o'clock is three o'clock. Two hours from two o'clock is four o'clock. Three hours from two o'clock is five o'clock. So here is what it looks like after three hours. It's five o'clock. Now let's talk about the minute hand. The minute hand is pointing to the one. Does it represent one minute? Well, one little space is one minute, two minutes, three minutes, four minutes. And five minutes. So the one is actually five minutes. The two is ten minutes. The three is fifteen minutes. The four is twenty minutes. The five is twenty-five minutes. The six is thirty minutes. The seven is thirty-five minutes. The eight is forty minutes. The nine is forty-five minutes. The ten is fifty minutes, and the eleven is fifty-five minutes. And we go back to zero. So, do you understand this? Like the two is ten minutes, the four is twenty minutes, the ten is fifty minutes. If you don't understand this. Please pause this video and think about it. Now let's look at this example over here. The minutes hand is between fifteen minutes and twenty minutes, which is the three and the four. So we count. This is sixteen minutes. This is seventeen minutes, and this is eighteen minutes. So the minute hand is pointing to. Eighteen minutes. Now let's do a couple examples of telling time. Here is our analog clock. First, let's look at the hours hand. The hours hand is pointing between four and five. According to the rule, it's four o'clock. Now let's look at the minute hand. The minute hand is pointing to the one. Which is five minutes. So the clock is showing four o five. Now 
let's do another example. First, let's look at the hours hand. The hour hand is pointing between six and seven. According to the rule, it is six o'clock. Now let's look at the minute hand. The minute hand is pointing between fifteen and twenty minutes. So here is sixteen minutes and seventeen minutes. So we have seventeen minutes. The time is six seventeen. If you like me, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your support. See you next time.